Our guest who is with us uh, joins us, and she has been in millions and of millions of, of, of homes uh, from the 600 Pound Life reality show. She was recently on an episode of Atlanta Live, where it's been seen by 100 million viewers. She's here on the Treva and Kevin show. Please welcome our dear friend Marla McCann. Hello, Marla. Hello. So good to see you nice today. To see you. I want to commend you because you lost more than 600 pounds. That's unbelievable. Not 60 pounds. Not 100 pounds. Not Wait. 300 pounds. I mean, you and I together may weigh 400 pounds, 350. I'm being honest. Uh, but yeah. can you imagine weighing, losing 600? No, I cannot. Marla, how are you today? I am great. You look amazing. <laughs> I love the hair. Look yes, at her, she Kevin. Is. She <laughs> is shining today. Too glamorous. Yeah. Glamorous. yeah. Thank you, thank you. And I know you love being here. Uh, of course, Kevin, what do you love about Mr. Kennedy when you oh, come? Oh, his sense of humor. <laughs> oh, right there, Marla. Tell it's her. Charisma. She's yeah. always so he's sweet so and funny. kind. He's we so love having her on. Yes, he so, is funny. What, a, what are some of the things that Kevin has said that has just stuck with you? Mm, let's see. <laughs> That's her. Every time we always hear this laughter and she's trying to hold him down. Yeah. I love his dancing. Uh, I did his uh, quotes out of the Bible Amen. all the time. All the time. Mm -hmm. all the time. Oh, wow. So how does that make you feel that you're affecting so many people? You well, you know, we've said all three of us want our life to count for him. That's right. So if it takes a little laughter, give God the glory. If it takes a little dance, yes. give God oh, the glory. And if it takes a word, <laughs> yes. give God the glory. So where do you get your energy from? Well, you know, I think I was just born with that. A natural amount of energy I had high energy. My mother said, "The boy never stops talking." And she used to talk when I was a little kid. <laughs> He's always talking. And uh, at my old one of my old churches, they said, "You know, Kevin, you're going to talk yourself into trouble." And I used to respond, "Yeah, and I'm going to talk myself out of trouble too." Yeah. And so uh, I guess they some say it's the gift of gab that I you believe have. Amen. Amen. Let the church say amen. Let the well, church. I believe Marla has that gift to influence people mm -hmm. and to affect positive change. And of course, I'm so excited because the the organization, the ministry I, I started uh, is called Lost Lynn and I share stories and Marla is here because you are working now with the organization and talk about something that you're doing with Lost. Right now I'm doing a, a session with widows. And you're not a widow. I'm not a widow. So help us to understand that. I've always um, liked being around older people. Okay. And, uh, and they're not always old and they're not because always, I'm young. Right. So young girl. Uh, I was invited to the meeting and uh -huh. I went and I really enjoyed myself. I really enjoy myself. Those women are really hurting. Mm -hmm. I'm a caring person. I've always been a caring person. So my heart just went out to them. Yes. I felt their pain uh, going through my whole ordeal. I always, you know, I was in a hospital and I witnessed people being there by themselves. It's a lonely feeling. Come on. It really is a lonely feeling. Nobody deserves mm -hmm. to feel like that. That's right. So if, if I come in contact with them, I'm going to uplift them. Amen. Wow. we got to make a difference. I love